Alright, so I got two silver and two bronze, and I'll come back and tell you what I took, if I remember them. Alright, so I had two bronze, two silver. I took Sinister. Damage plus 40%. Works only when the enemy is affected by blinding. That's under the fast silver. Strong silver. I took Mortar Blow 2. Damage plus 25%. See, nothing from any of the... Oh, no, 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 no. I did not take Mortal Blow 2. No, no, I took... This. Sev Sever Sinews 2. Pain plus 40%. Works only when opponent has less than 25% vitality. That's the fast steal. And then under Yurdin, I took level 3. Causes pain. Char 6 charges and side intensity is plus 50%. So it's going to do more damage now. And also under Stamina, I took Brawn. Which is Endurance Consumed on Attacks is minus 25%. So let's meditate on that, and we're going to head out to town and uh, turn in these contracts after. What is it? I'm here about the notice. Right. You have the juices? I do. Splendid. Here's the gold. Two hundred orins. Taken over the larger hall upstairs. How are we supposed to fit down here? I'm here about the notice. Which one? The kicking more claws. I'll pay if you have ten. Ten claws. Your gold. Nice. Two hundred orins. Yay. Alrighty, so I finally got enough cash to buy the excellent leather jacket so this is where we've replaced my studded leather jacket which is damage received minus five percent the excellent leather jacket damage received minus fifteen percent pain resistance plus ten percent resistance to bleeding plus ten percent incinerate res resistance ten percent poison resistance plus ten percent so let's do it Yes, I am. There it is. Oh, and look, and I gained a, uh, I, ca I gained a quick slot, which is what I was hoping. So, uh, there's the old. <laughs> I should be able to sell this. Can I sell it? Oh, he's not. Actually, he's not interested in it. Yeah, he's just gonna have to sit there, I guess. So, uh, now I'll be able to play with bombs a little. So let's see, that, uh, the swallow was six. So a bomb might be like seven. Yeah, so I'm gonna have to play with those a little, because I have lots of bomb ingredients. So I'm gonna go make some bombs. And, uh, one of each, one or two of each, and see how, how they work. Alrighty, we're back out here at the swamp. I just teleported to the tower. And we're gonna try out some of these bombs. I made one of each that I could that I have the recipes for. This is the king and queen. I made a few of these. These magically evoke fear in nearby opponents. And then I also have let's see, there should be four of them. I just not used to seeing what they look like. Dragon's Dream frees a flammable and explosive gas. The Samum it stuns nearby opponents. And the Zeracadian Sun blinds nearby opponents. So let's try this one first, the King and Queen. I'm not sure if it will work on anything. It might scare some drowners, I guess, but uh So I think it's gonna be seven is gonna be the key I need to press. Let's just go find some bad guys. Mm. 
or even one bad guy would, would do. Okay, here we got a drowner. Let's try it. It does scare him. Nice. Oh, hey. <laughs> like it's uh it definitely gives you a chance to like regroup if you're being uh attacked or whatever okay let's try uh one of these other ones so that was a king and queen so this is a, f a flammable and explosive gas so let's try that one that one sounds fun I'd love to find that island of, uh, Bloods... Oh, here's one. Let's see how this works on him. I'd prefer to be more than one, but whatever. Didn't do nothing. Did I throw it? Oh, I see. It's right here. So it doesn't do anything with him. Unless maybe you have to do that. No, it doesn't uh it doesn't do anything. To them anyway. Hmm. Let's go find a different monster and try it on them. This is big Kiki more uh, warrior over here. Let's try it on him. So that one didn't work on the blood zingers or the bugs. Oh wait, what the hell's that going on over there? There's a fight between some Kikimons and drowned deads. It looks like or Kiki more. Excuse me. So uh, let's try another one over there. Uh, let's see. That was that one. This one stuns. That one blinds. So let's try stun. Ha <laughs> ha 
as I can tell, it's just gonna be better for humans. Last one is the Zeracanian Sun. That's a blinding one. So that might work on Drowners. Where is he? I heard you. There he is. Right, let's try it on this one. No, nope, it doesn't work on him. I think I can find out what is going to work on what by uh, looking at their glossary. I think in here it tells them what they what they're uh, weak against. Immune. Oh, I see. See, immune immune to bleeding, blinding, and poison attempts. So uh, I could just. Depending on where I'm, what I'm gonna do, I could. Uh, it's like if I knew I was gonna fight a bunch of drowned dead, I could have the fear, of the uh, king and queen, which causes fear. So that's cool. There is one more um, that I couldn't make because I didn't have a unique ingredient. This, that's not it. It was right, Devil's Puffball. Upon detonation, this bomb sprays a cloud of poison, affecting nearby enemies, thus those resistant to poison might not be harmed. A devil's puffball is made by mixing ingredients providing one measure of each of rebus and hydranium and two measures of ether. High quality black powder must be used as a base. So I'm not sure what the unique ingredient is, but I don't have it. 